In aviation, the flight length is defined as the distance of a flight. Commercial flights are often categorized into long, medium or short haul by commercial airlines based on flight length, although there is no international standard definition and many airlines use air time or geographic boundaries instead. Route category lengths tend to define short haul routes as being shorter than 600 to 800 nmi, 1100 to 1500 kilometers. Long haul as being longer than 2200 to 2600 nmi, 4100 to 4800 kilometers, and medium haul as being in between. Topic: Root category definitions. Topic: Asia and Australia. Japan Airlines defines routes to Europe and North America as long haul, and all other flights as short haul. Virgin Australia defines domestic flights as within Australia, short haul as those to Southeast Asia, Pacific, and long haul as those to Abu Dhabi or Los Angeles. The Hong Kong Airport considers destinations in North and South Americas, Europe, the Middle East, Africa, Southwest Pacific and the Indian subcontinent long haul and all others are short haul. Europe Eurocontrol defines short haul routes as shorter than 1500 kilometers, 930 miles, 810 nmi, medium haul between 1500 and 4000 kilometers, 930 and 2490 miles, 810 and 2160 nmi, and long haul routes as longer than 4000 kilometers, 2500 miles, 2000 200 nmi. The Association of European Airlines defines long haul as flights to Americas, Sub-Saharan Africa, Asia, Australasia and medium haul as flights to North Africa and Middle East. The now defunct airline Air Berlin defined short and medium haul as flights to Europe, North Africa and long haul as those to the rest of the world. Air France defines short haul as domestic, medium haul as within Europe, North Africa and long haul as the rest of the world. North America American Airlines define short medium haul flights as being less than 3000 miles, 2600 nmi, 4800 kilometers and long haul as either being more than 3000 miles, 2600 nmi, 4800 kilometers or being the New York Los Angeles and New York San Francisco routes. United Airlines defines short haul flights as being less than 700 miles, 610 nmi, 1100 kilometers and long haul flights as being greater than 3000 miles, 2600 nmi, 4800 kilometers. Topic: Aircraft category definitions. Delta Air Lines defines its Boeing 717, MD-88 and MD-90 as short-haul domestic aircraft, Boeing 757 Boeing 737, Airbus A319 and A321 as long-haul domestic and Boeing 777, B-767, B-747, Airbus A330 and Transoceanic Boeing 757 as long haul. 
Lufthansa defines its fleet as long haul for wide body aircraft such as the Airbus A330, A340, A350, and A380, or Boeing 747, medium haul for narrow body aircraft like the A320 and B737 families, and short haul for regional jets like the Embraer E jets or the Bombardier CRJ900. Thomson Airways defines the Boeing 737 as a short and mid-haul airliner while the Boeing 767 and B787 is long-haul, while they are capable of flying further, long-haul widebodies are often used on shorter trips, 40% of A350 routes are shorter than 2000 nmi 2300 miles, 3700 km, 50% of A380 flights fall within 2000 to 4000 nmi 2300 to 4600 miles 3700 to 7400 kilometers 70% 70 of 777 to 200 er routes are shorter than 4000 nmi 4600 miles 7400 kilometers 80% of 787 9s routes are shorter than 5000 nmi 5800 miles 9300 kilometers 70% of 777 to 200 lrs flights are shorter than 6000 nmi 6900 miles 11000 kilometers and 777 to 300 ers flights are evenly distributed across its range Superlative flights <laughs> Shortest commercial flight The Westray to Papa Westray flight in Orkney, operated by Loganair, is the shortest commercial flight in the world over 2.8 kilometers, 1.7 miles in 2 minutes scheduled flight time including taxiing. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Longest commercial flight From the 11th of October 2018, the longest commercial flight is the Singapore Airlines flight SQ212 seconds, 23/24 between Singapore Chani and New York, Newark, covering 15,344 kilometers, 9,534 miles, 8,285 nmi, with an Airbus A35900 ULR in nearly 19 hours. Hours, with 161 seats, 67 business and 94 premium economy. Distinctions Absolute distance versus flight length The absolute distance between two points is the great circle distance, which is always the shortest geographical route. In the example right, the aircraft traveling westward from North America to Japan is following a great circle route extending northward towards the Arctic region. The apparent curve of the route is a result of distortion when plotted onto a conventional map projection and makes the route appear to be longer than it really is. Stretching a string between North America and Japan on a globe will demonstrate why this really is the shortest route despite appearances. The actual flight length is the length of the track flown across the ground in practice, which is usually longer than the ideal great circle and is influenced by a number of factors such as the need to avoid bad weather, wind direction and speed, fuel economy, navigational restrictions and other requirements. 
In the example, easterly flights from Japan to North America are shown taking a longer, more southerly, route than the shorter Great Circle, this is to take advantage of the favorable jet stream, a fast, high-altitude tailwind, that assists the aircraft along its ground track saving more time and fuel than the geographically shortest route. Air time versus schedule times Air time is the elapsed time that the aircraft is airborne, regardless of what time zone the flight began and ended in. Schedule time is the difference between the scheduled local time at the origin and the scheduled local time at the destination and usually differs from the actual time in the air as it is affected by the local time zones. Local clock time flying westward, or chasing the sun, is slowed, while local clock time flying eastbound is sped up. However, flights over the international date line located at approximately 180 OE in the Pacific will subtract 24 hours from the scheduled time going eastwards and add 24 hours going westwards. For example, the eastward flight shown in the example from Japan to North America will have a scheduled time of arrival earlier than the departure time, while from North America to Japan the flight will take a whole day longer by local time, the actual flying time in both cases being the same or similar. See also Endurance aeronautics Range aeronautics List of regional airliners International flight Non-stop flight Flight distance record